it was traditionally a like a journalism 101 curriculum and we had the kids report in print for the most part but through a number of trips uh, through to go to Pennsylvania before the election we went to New Hampshire all these trips we started to develop more with media so we started to look past writing and past of course using the writing but what we started to find was that the kids wanted to be a little bit more multimedia, learn more skills, understand a little bit more about technology and reporting. And what we realized is we want the course to be more about being a 21st century journalist. So that's when we built this studio that we're in now. And that's when we started to consider the idea that radio is actually reinventing itself so quickly. Let's try something really innovative. And so now the kids, we dedicate the entire course to teaching them how to do sound reporting and how to report for the radio itself. Universities have always thought about multifaceted approaches when it comes to journalism. What we want to do here is try and get kids to build portfolios earlier because they know that they'll be applying to purchase, to CUNY, to CUNY Journalism School, to Columbia maybe. So our point is why not give them a leg up so that they build that portfolio earlier. They should be learning these skills in high school before they get to college and then they can build on their skills even more so when they get there. What we decided was we started just making a few podcasts to be honest, in the studio, me and a colleague, and we talked about education, and then we realized we needed a place where we could bank a lot of our stories. So we thought about it, and we realized NPR would be cool, because it is Mammonic Public Radio, and also people kind of have in their head NPR all the time, too. But we figured that this would be a place, and we're working toward building something where the kids will be able to report on what is happening in their community, because there is such a hole and a gap right now with local news across the board, across our country. So it would be really interesting if the kids, we want them in some way civically to give back to their community. And that's kind of where this whole concept of NPR started, but now it's getting into maybe another phase and we're going to start growing it as the course continues to grow. Well, I think they find it amazing because it's so different. So when I, even now, when I have second semester seniors, they come to my class and it's so different. I mean, we spent the day today talking about ambient sound, sound effects. We talked about how that layers into a story. So it's, it's not just about writing, which of course is there, it's more about being a storyteller and those skills that are associated with that. So it's a lot of fun and what I find that kids, and once they get in, it's so different. The skills and the way in which we interpret what happens to people or what we want to talk about or the interview or the approach we want to give to the audience. This is so different because it's about the ear and it's about capturing people's attention. There's nothing like sitting and listening to something that really moves you. I think it's more intimate than even watching a film.